love from love, hope from hope, peace from our Prince of Peace. The Lord God, he says to all people, I am the key to everyone's heart and the one who sh shuts the door to every man. Joy is an inside job and God has given us a door on the inside of our heart that only, only he can knock on the outside of our heart, but only we can open that. And if we open our hearts to love, we will begin burning like never before. And forget compulsive, obsessive. Let's talk passion. Let's talk fervency. Let's talk excitement. Let's talk a reason for getting out of bed each day. So praise God. And, O oh, beloved of Christ, please understand well that the darkest days of the forthcoming tribulation will usher in some terribly bleak days when spiritual poverty will become the norm if people will not heed the word of love from this channel. For bankrupted hearts will be cashing out left and right while foolishly chasing after the abundance of, of stuff that is of no profit to them. Uh, we must embrace the things that last forever, which is everlasting life and everlasting love that only comes by keeping our love alive to keep us away from committing the unforgivable sin of letting his light in us go out. Many are going to say, Lord, Lord, and he's going to say, I don't even know you. You believe, but it doesn't matter because you let my light go out in you and you let your love wax cold. You needed to be born again to be like a little child with your love in motion as a verb instead of letting it wax cold and die a death of waxing cold in the land of the walking dead where you have a form of godliness but deny the power thereof and because of this many people will be cashing out bankrupted hearts uh, left and right while chasing after a bunch of garbage that's in the wake of the shadow of death and it'll come to pass for if people will not believe God's word flowing anew that the bronze shall suddenly take back the back seat uh, to brains as so-called smart people of the world they, as they start racing down some crooked roads of some badly tainted bad attitudes and unloving ways but no signs will be posted anywhere to warn anyone about those real dangerous directions but God is sending a compass and he's sending it now and uh, otherwise it will bring multitude of lost souls to the edge of madness uh, of the maddest madness if they will not uh, hear God's word that he loves us all exactly the same he's saying to all of us if we and he's pleading with all flesh he's saying i will be your god you will be my people i will forgive your iniquity i will never remember it i will write my law and my love upon your hearts beyond that no one will ever even need to be taught of me anymore says the lord god for all shall know me from the least to the greatest of all mankind once you know that i am unconditional love over all people, there is nothing more that I could tell you about me, says the Lord God. And so, all otherwise, it will become, if people will not believe this message, it will become rebellious days when those unmarked paths will swiftly lead unenlightened, unloving rejects of humanity to the very worst kind of dismal places. And it will become common for the unloving seed of humanity to even betray their very own parents through great wickedness. And behold, many unloving children will re rebel, like becoming like serpents filled with the bitterness of many spiritual toxins. But they'll never profit anything at all by their betrayal for their very own poisons will only be added to the very long list of their sins as their ungodly actions become as the gods that they worship and they they on the path to perishing as they let their love light die and they will be judged if they're not walking in the spirit of love that is what the word of god says and those days of wickedness would be flaring up like the flames of hell upon earth if people are walking in unloving ways being giving uh, their own selfish greed uh, a place in their heart as god instead of loving other people without condemnation without judging and uh, know that 
awful deeds of many children will be filling up the very long measure of their endless unloving transgressions. So it's time to turn away from such a dismal scene because that would, uh, it's the end of the road. It's a complete dead end. And we would have, we'd be all dressed up and we'd have absolutely no place to go except to hell from whence we send ourselves.